Please download Telugu Stop Android app in Play Store or iOS app in App Store and stay tuned to latest news as it happens. Hyderabad, January 22nd. Telangana Chief Minister A. Ravent Reddy on Monday returned from his week-long visit to three nations. H. Venugopal Rao, who was Sunday appointed as advisor to the government on protocol and public relations, welcomed the Chief Minister at the Rajiv Gandhi International Airport. Ravens Reddy along with Minister for Information Technology and Industries D. Srida Babu and some officials participated in the World Economic Forum annual meeting in Davos, Switzerland. The Chief Minister later visited London while Dubai was the last stop of his foreign visit, the first visit after assuming office as the Chief Minister last month. The government claimed that the visit was highly successful as the state signed investment deals worth over 40,000 crore rupees with various companies on the sidelines of WEF conclave. This is nearly double the amount the state could muster last year at Davos. The investment concluded positively with Adani Group, JSW, Webworks, Tata Technologies, BL Agro, Surgical Instruments Group Holdings, Godi Energy, Aragon Life Sciences, Innovera Pharmaceuticals, Q Centrio, Sistra, Uber and O9 Solutions, have a new potential of creating over 2,500 jobs directly. In London and Dubai, the focus of Raven Reddy's visit was on his plans for rejuvenation of Musi River in Hyderabad. His visit to London was aimed at learning about the management of River Thames, understanding and gathering insights from its management and collating best practices. He held discussions with officials and experts of the Port of London Authority, the governing body of River Thames. Raven Reddy on Sunday visited Dubai Waterfront. The team was shown the linkage between water, land and building, and its socio-economic impact on hyper-local communities. The team also discussed project management issues, including international funding and investment possibilities, execution challenges, costs and timelines, and its replication possibilities in Hyderabad as part of the Musi River Rejuvenation Project. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.